On your mark, ready, set. What's up guys, it's Philip with Molly. And as you see, we got a bear as a guest. So what's the difference between these two dogs? The Rottweiler is a so-called working dog. There is a sport called IPO, which is basically divided into three areas, obedience, tracking, and protectiveness. Dogs that has the highest success chance in IPO, I'm probably gonna butcher this name now, but it's the Malinois, the German Shepherd, and then the Rottweiler. This is why they are used within the military and the police force now these modern days it's more common that the rottweiler is used as a family and exhibition dog and even though the amstaff is equally energetic and willing to learn as the rottweiler i'm not allowed to compete in ipo in sweden according to the authorities the amstaff is not a working dog now if you take the word working dog literally yes the amstaff is a working dog but what they are talking about when they say working dog is basically about the sports that is included into working dogs now I hope I make any sense. Now these days the Amstaff is mostly used as a family dog but just to be clear obviously you can practice whatever you want with your dog but you will have a higher chance of success depending on the breed and what you are doing. If you guys are interested I can go into further details about the different characteristic and genetic futures in another video but for now we're gonna have a little competition. I want to find out who's the fastest between the Rottweiler and the Amstaff. All right, dogs, we've been through the rules. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. Run as fast as you can. The first one who gets to the stick will not only win honor and glamour, but you will win this treat. If you want to touch paws, touch them now. All right. On your mark, ready, set, motion good. <laughs> Good job, Vegas. Good try. And we have a winner. <laughs> Vegas, did you find another stick? Good boy. Yes, you find. <laughs> Both of them are winners, obviously. Ah, oh, good boy. Good boy. Good boy. <laughs> oh, shit. Good boy, good boy. Oh, you're so happy. You're so happy. Lost. Sit. Leg. Look at how beautiful he lays down now. Leg. Oh. <laughs> you don't want a rotten stick? Oh, let's get another one. Come on. Well, it appeared like Molly won mostly from the acceleration. I wonder who's the fastest if I let them accelerate to the top speed. Let's find that out. I will let them run one by one for this one. So they will start at this mark. And when they reach this blue stick, I will start the timer. And when they reach the red stick, the timer will stop. Vegas, swing! And the timer stops. And it stops. <laughs> 2.86, good job. No, that's the mark, that's the end mark. Come on, dog. come on, dog. Come on. Los. Stanna. You don't want to compete, do you? You don't want to compete. Stay there. We will compete. This is serious, dogs. Come on. This is serious. On your mark, ready, set. Molly, spring. And there starts the timer. <laughs> all right so molly's time is 250 she didn't really understand the rules so let's just sum it all up the amstaff is faster and more athletic but the rottweiler is way smarter i love both of these dogs i love how athletic and energetic the amstaff is and i love how strong and easy to work with the rottweiler is if you're not going to do anything specific with your dog whether you get a rottweiler or an amstaff is 100 percent subjective both of these dogs are perfect family dogs but don't think you can get these type of dogs without putting a lot of work into it if you're not committed into training and working with your dog i would recommend not get this type of dog or any dog for that matter hope you enjoyed this video as much as i did even though i'm sick and it's raining and if you haven't subscribed to this channel already make sure to smash that subscribe button also follow me on instagram at inside the dog world peace